Yo, yo, yo! What is up, guys? It's your boy, BF Prodigy, and I'm back with another video. I'm back with some more Mafia now, guys. Before we get into the gameplay, I just wanted to say a couple things. First of all, I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you do, smash the like button. And if you want more of this and you want me to keep dropping these videos out for you as quick as possible, then simply keep smacking the like button. Alright guys, smash the like button. I'll keep do doing that. I'll keep dropping those vid these videos out for you as quick as possible. And also guys, subscribe if you are new. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like if you aren't even subscribed, then what are you doing? Go down below. Hit the subscribe button while you're down there. Hit the post notification so you don't miss a thing in the future. Also, 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 thank you so much for all you guys' support on the channel and especially on the Mafia series so far. It's been tremendous. I can't even thank you guys enough. Keep it on. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna quit talking without further ado. Let's get into the gameplay, guys. You dig? The truck was destroyed. Well, bro, this guy literally... This guy flung me up in the air, my guy. Dude, if only you could customize your suit or get different suits, bro, I'd, I'd pick like a purple or a red one, bro, no cavity. How the hell did Morello hear about my deal? All kinds of beavers in this city. For now, let's get the booze back to the warehouse and try not to die. <laughs> The hell is this? They really want that alcohol, bro? Like, holy moly. I think we lost them all. Thank Christ for that. Let's head home. See what we got. We got the booze. I mean, I know it didn't go to plan, but... We got the booze. Maybe they're following yeah. us. But tonight, me and you are gonna drink a bunch of it. I guess we earned that much. Looks like a 38. Morello's boys caught up with you? Yeah, boss. We took care of it. What about the kid from Kentucky? Uh, he took a slug to the shoulder. But uh, he's a tough blocker. He and his crew dusted out as soon as we bumped off Morello's hatchet meth. Getting shot will give Gates and his pop another reason to ice Morello out of the whiskey business. Well, let's see if this hooch was worth all the trouble.
<laughs> Excellent. I'll work out the details of Papa Gates. But once we're running this Kentucky Brown, we'll be back in brass buttons. Good work, son. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of all of you. Saludo. Saludo. Well, if that was poison, then they'd all be dead, so... Let's hope it's not poison. Intermezzo, 1938. Sounds like Salieri was getting ready to make his move. Woken up to it, maybe. But then, prohibition ended. And a bootlegging business got knocked on its ass. All that fighting over booze, man, next to nothing. It took us a few years to recover. But when we did bounce back, boy, it was something. We took what dough we had from the moonshine Canadian whiskey and invested it into new records. Some of them even leave. We branched out into everything, except peddling dope. By 35, things were looking up. We had good money rolling in on the regular. I had a wife and daughter. Sam was running a club for the Don. Even Paulie had a few records of his own. Wasn't exactly happy, but what do you call it there? Content. Yeah. That was it. And Salieri, he finally starts talking about getting out of Morello's shadow. Maybe buying our own cops, our own politicians. Hmm. That's interesting. You think Salieri was sourcing high binders from 34? Maybe. Wait. Well, a few years back, a voice squad got a judge on solicitation of a minor. Once in the box, he started confessing all sorts of misbehaving, trying to get a deal. But he copped to taking kickbacks from Rollo and your man Salieri. Playing him off one another, trying to goose the take, but... Once Morello found out, he threatened to bury the judge's kids in the beach, still breathing, of course. Christ. That was a missing piece. How was that? Morello was always winding us up, but he never did anything that might start an all-out war. Learning Celieri was building his own bench must have finally tipped his scales, because in 35, he hit us with both barrels. Oh, shit. Bon Appetit, 1935. Pasted it on his face. Hey, oh, hey, boss, what's going on? I'm glad you're here. There you go, boss. You want a Pepe's for lunch, but Carlo called in sick. You up for a drive? Sure, boss. Bravo. I'm already starving. You got a piece on you? Yeah. You think I'll need it? Eh, you know how it is. Things with Morello have been a little quiet lately. Maybe it's just got me jumpy, is all. All right, uh... Oh, shit, are we taking that car? All right. Man, golly! Traffic's sorted out. So how's business, Tom? Hey, you know how it is. It's good. Sure, I know the business. I see the books every day. But since what happened, happened, I know that a capo needs to talk to his soldiers without some other guy getting in the way. Bro, what's this guy doing? What you honking? We got on the pad. Anything's better than those grifters trying to shift their hooch before the 21st went through. Ah, this is only the start of it, Tom. I got plans. Plenty of good people lining up for a slice. I'm tired of being up Let behind this it. truck, bro. Fuck off. Be nice for you. Some time away from Polly and his cockamamie schemes. Well, that's been a conversation, boss. I'll give you that. <laughs> sure I am. Me, Sam, and Polly, though, we're still real tight. We've been through some times together. Yeah, don't I know it. Bro, what's this guy doing? Going straight like that.
Something must go down because if this is just a ride to dinner... See you, Pepe. Yes. Hey, come. Our guest has arrived, eh? What's on the menu today? My mother. <laughs> I she left. would be so honored if you tried her caponada. Excellently. Bravo, bravo. Oh, Pepe, oh, let me get you a chair for you, huh? See, please. Bruh, what the heck? Some treatment you got. I had to get my own chair. <laughs> I've been saving this just for you. Yeah, bene, bene, bene. Uh, enjoy, huh? I'm glad you're off the roof, Tom. Uh, Sarah threatened to leave me if I didn't dry out. I know. She told you? No. I put her up to it. What do you mean off the roof? Sloppy, Tom. I didn't want you to make a mistake we couldn't live with. For you, and for you. Ah, Peppy, the meal is a masterpiece as always. <laughs> Molto grazie, Don Salieri. Praise from such a gourmet as you, it filled me with a joy. Now, you wouldn't call me a gourmet if you knew what I had for supper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Get down. Get down! Let me finish my wine. Hey, Salieri! Come out of there and we'll make this quick. Smoke him out, Joe. Bro, he's dead, bro. You got him. Shit, watch out! Slip out the back and circle. All right. You sure, boss? Blow them all down, Tommy. Not one of them goes home tonight. Okay, boss. Be careful. Tom, just be quick about it. All right, bro. Bro, where's Sam? Come on! Peek out!
How do I... Bro, they know my name. They scared of me, bro. <sighs> if only you could upgrade your guns. Yo, that's sick. That's dope. Look at that. Looks badass. <laughs> bro, this guy's taking hits. Where's the Tommy guns? The shoddy will do. my ass, Tom. We gotta go, boss. The cops will be here soon. I need a minute to catch my breath. Well, let me get you back to the bar. No, not the bar. We're going to see Carlo. That son of a bitch knew where I was going today, and he calls in sick. He set you up. <laughs> to us, Tom, you could have ended up just as dead. Yeah, I know, boss. Carlo's jacked up with some Damon Holbrook. Let's go see what he has to say about all this. Alright, fuck this Carlos, bro. It's how Polly treated you, huh? We gotta go. Step on it, Tom. Every minute Carlos still breathing is a minute that's got me pissed. Sure, boss. Can't believe these bastards had the brass balls to wreck my car. Had to be Carlo, didn't it? His pop was tight with Morello right when we started out. Apple don't fall far from the tree, huh? I wept at his funeral. And his sons will be laughing loud. His mom's already a widow, Tom, and now he's gonna make her lonely till the day she dies. For what? Some dough to buy his dope? And my foot through his face. You know what? I'm glad. I'm glad this happened. I get to plug another rat, and we finally go to the mattresses with Morello. Today's the day that damn breaks. Sure feels like it. So did we fall out? You give him a place in your family. You not fall out, but did we like? Are we not? Are we? Are we not working no more? Like. Okay, so that one's new. Pretty sure no, that one's not. Give him respect. And this, this is how he repays you? Because he if said that this, what else is he she, Sarah is going to leave Run, him if he house, didn't um, stop doing Any of them whatever that. I think, it was was he referring to runs with the, was he referring to jobs? Why don't you 
let me go first, huh? Garlo might be waiting for us. No, Tom. My face is going to be the first and last thing this bastard sees. <laughs> Bruh. What the fuck? You goddamn dirty grifter. You better dangle, sweetheart. It's gonna be a closed casket, Carlo. Right before he got denied? You okay, bus? Yeah, just a little. Let me catch my breath. Jesus, he's fast for a big guy. Don't let him get away! Help! Help me, someone! Come back here, Carlo! Nice move. So if you weren't, so if you weren't guilty, no, you can. If you weren't guilty, you wouldn't have pushed the boss. Fuck no. Come here, you little shit. Let me talk to the boss. I can explain everything. Tommy, you gotta know, Morello, he was gonna kill mom. I had to do it. I had to. They made me do it, Tommy. Please, I can explain. There's only so many rules in this life. Is he still alive? I'm not sure. I only shot him in the ass. Golly! Recognized you. You said you were having some trouble down at the docks, right? Yeah, but it's nothing I can't handle. Yeah, well, I did some asking around. This asshole was planning a strike. Strikes are no good for business. Unless you don't want to call him for it, right? <laughs> right. So I decided the union needed a change in leadership. Is that all right with you? Of course. Now, what about that, uh, other thing? That's why I'm here. Salieri's still alive. God damn it! What happened? I don't know yet. Crew we sent is dead. Restaurants all shot to hell. Stop your crying. I don't have a conversation here. What about the uh, cockroach Carlo? Found him with his head smashed in like a fucking watermelon. Never seen anything like it. Mm. So yeah, he must have figured Carlo was the rat. God damn it. I even hear myself think. It's gonna be a war. I told you to shut the fuck up! Golly! This guy really hates Salary. Salary. Yeah, no, the fuck you say his name, bro? What do you want me to do? Salary. Salary. Make it round. I'm just going to calm down, bro. Tell little boys to keep their eyes peeled and the powder dry. Okay. Put the word out. Hey. Just uh, keep your head down, bro. You too, Don Morello. So, are they? No, they can't be brothers. Solar isn't Don. Isn't it Don Solari as well? Happy birthday, nineteen thirty-five. Regular 
me, Sam, and Polly are the OGs, bro. We're like the co's. Like, what you mean, bro? But Vinny told me I gotta stay around the bar for my old sister's safety. Bro, this game's been tremendous. Gotta get, get, get a new cooker car for the Don pinched from someplace too. He only will wants the best. You need it up the stairs. I'll go straight up. It's war thumb. From today we are at war. We're soon. Where's Sarah, bro? Where's Sarah, bro? Where is Sarah, bro? Hey, you true the Don slipped Carla the bum? Not you? Yeah. Wasn't pretty. Still blood in his veins, huh? Less than Carlos. Keeping out of trouble, I hope. Good. We're finally going after him. Soon. But first we have to soften him up. Morel's got the cops, the politicians, and even some judges in his pocket. We can't afford to bite them all off. So we need to scare them into abandoning Morella's sinking ship. If we bump off the right idiot, the rest are going to realize sticking with Morello ain't too good for their help. First in line for the pine box is this <laughs> Hey, what's up, Vinny? <laughs> The counselor's still seeing red over his dead kid, so he's never going to turn on Morello. Christ. That guy's been giving us fits since 32. Let me take care of him, boss. Why do you think you're here? Then he's got it all figured out. The is celebrating his birthday with a big shindig on a steamboat. Pulling out all the stops. Boots, broads, fireworks. He's even giving a speech to the press. What kind of security? Just did normal detail a few guys. Just give me a sniper and I'll snipe him, bro. Are gonna do dick to protect that piece of shit. I'll quick okay. scope him. I'll talk my way to the party, put two on his head. Slow down, Junior. Galati's corrupt, but he ain't stupid. His crew be searching everyone who comes on board, so you can't be carried. So what? Um, throw him overboard, see if he can swim. Don't go getting creative on me. You're still going to shoot him for fuck's sake. <laughs> when you get on deck, you make for the head. We got a janitor on the take, and he's planted a revolver in the bathroom. And then you just cool your heels. Mingle. Try not to look like a hatchet man until Galati makes his appearance. You wait for that bastard to start his speech, and only then do you put one between his eyes. We want it done in public to get people talking. Sure. But you got a plan for getting back to shore? Sam and Paulie are down the docks working on that. You meet up with him there. And I'll fill you in on the rest of the details. So I can't okay. take that Tommy gun? She's looking extra fine on that table. The lot is done, boss. You won't have to worry about him after tonight. I don't doubt it, Tommy. Born a fortuna, Tom. Let's fucking do it, bro. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, uh... Big steps, big steps. 
Big steps, big steps, big steps, big steps. Alright, so we gotta take one of these. I actually kind of want that car. Some fine parking, if you ask me. Attention, folks, attention. We'll get you all aboard, but we will need to see tickets. You'll also be searched for safety. Thank the you finest for family in the city. Tickets? Ah, uh, party schedule, yeah. Find Sam's. Sam must be getting us the tickets. You don't look like a guy with an invite. I got friends. Just not these kind of friends. Well, I'll tell you what I got. Sailor back there who works on the steamer. His head hit something heavy. But his dandy white suit's fine. Thanks. I'll go find him. To whom it may concern, I write in reference reference to my forthcoming event on the Lest, Lost Heaven Queen. I was today warned by an associate about a potential threat to my safety. As such, I will be I will be bringing my own security staff to the party. Only those holding tickets will be allowed on board. Your crew will not be admitted into the bar area. I will only be mixing with my closest friends there. All the Lost Heaven cr Queen crew must be on the lookout for suspicious ha behavior. Man, this guy's scared. Scared for his life. Oh, he's taking a shit. Sam, you came in here and you hit his head while he was taking a shit? Bro, these clothes probably smell like shit. Okay. Marsu Morello. Okay, the man in the white suit, the criminal without criminals fear. Morello is a friend to establishment in high society all the while. Corrupting them from the inside, he murders, he exploits, and he profits, impulsively moving from one illegal enterprise to the next. Ever since the death of the notorious, the notorious crime lord Don Peponi, Mar Pepone, Morello has been the dominant force felt in Lost Heaven. Few dare to stand against him, those who do rarely live along. What about... What about him, though? E 
Ennio Salieri. Salieri. In 1908, Ennio first stood on American soil without a dime to his name. Within 10 years, he was a capo to the infamous Don Papone. Within 20, the head of his own family, the good folk of Little Italy, lost heaven. He seem, see him as a champion of the common man. But the police department begs to differ. His charge sheet will be a litany of smuggling, extortion, swindling, and murder if, of course, anyone ever manages to haul him in. Know you'd get a real job someday. So remember, play it cool. When you've gone some ways over the water, find the gun. The janitor stashed it in the bathroom. Sure. Then get up on the roof. Wait for Galati's speech and pop him when he's done. How do I get away? Polly's borrowed a speedboat. After the speech, there's fireworks. We'll come soon as we've seen him. You better be there on time. Don't worry. It'll go smooth like eggs and coffee. Looking good, Tom. The outfit don't get messed up. Keep it. <laughs> ya. Fuck you, Polly. You the new guy? Christ, I took your time. You think he's gonna pull this off? Sure as shit gonna kill Galati. Getting off that boat? Well, he's gonna need a guardian angel. You don't need no fucking angel. He's got us looking out for him. Bro, I appreciate it, Polly, but I can look out for myself. Ugh. But we can work together. Ugh. So you right, you right. Done? Who are you yeah. talking to? I was gonna go clean the bathrooms. Heard some guests complaining. You're volunteering to clean toilets? <laughs> Whatever. You got a rag there. Check I didn't desk. volunteer. Actually, I kind of did, actually, because the bathroom, the gun's in the bathroom. Uh, my dear friend Roberto, first I must apologize for not attending your party tomorrow. Tensions grew high in the city today. It is unwise for me to show my face. On that note, you should have already, you should have already taken receipt of some men I have sent to protect you. When I am at risk, we are all at risk. Please do not worry and enjoy your day. Soon, s uh, soon, sal salary. Salary, salary, salary. I really need to hear his name again so I can pronounce it. Okay, we'll be dead and buried alongside Frank Coletti. Frank's not dead, buddy. At that point and not before, we will celebrate your birthday and how Enio will not live to see another. Marku. Marku. Shut up, bro. Marku. You got a coat. Okay, stairs are down here. Ooh, hey.
ask the crew about the janitor. Oh, you took your thing. Tommy, right? I hid the gun in the john in the stern. Mid deck. Where's third? Next floor up. Right above us. Eh, keys on the table there. You ever say my name again, you'll be found floating outside. Get that? Uh, yeah, I, I get that. Okay. Try it. That hurts. I'm gonna hide your body. Any bullets? Where did bot? Where where did his body go? <laughs> don't know. Don't know. Don't care. Dude, he left. How convenient. Okay, we gotta wait until he does his speech. Hey, John. Hope you're enjoying yourself. As long as the bar stays open, counselor. <laughs> Good man. Have a note for me, huh? Good to see you. Thanks for coming. Hey, thank you, everyone. Yeah, thank you. Hey, welcome to my wait for, right? <laughs> wait for the fireworks. So, as you all know, it has been a tough time. Three years ago, my dear son, Billy, left us. An innocent pawn in a deadly gang war. A victim of the deceased, that is, organized crime. Since that day, I have lived only to eradicate this disease. Today is a day for celebration for my 50th birthday. And for a brighter future, for lost heaven. The criminals will be driven out of town. They'll drown like rats in the water. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. And now for the fireworks, huh? The hell do I get out? Get 
I think I shot someone. Uh, go please. What the hell? Why can't I fucking hit him? Dude, you got me right when I was itching my nose, you fat bastard. Get us out of here. Man, it's a happy birthday. Like, I thought it was Tommy's birthday, bro. It was like, shit. But holy hell. We killed someone on his birthday, bro. And that's kind of messed up. Best birthday present ever. Worst birthday present ever. Alright guys, so that's going to conclude matters for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, smash the like button. And if you want more of this and you want me to keep dropping these videos out for you as quick as possible, then simply keep smacking the like button. Alright guys, smash the like button. I'll keep dropping these videos out for you as quick as possible. That's one of the easiest ways to let me know that you want more. And uh, also, guys, subscribe if you are new. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like, if you are even subscribed, then what are you doing? Go down below. Hit the subscribe button. And while you're down there, hit the post notifications so you don't miss a day in the future. Also, 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 thank you so much for all you guys' support on the channel. And especially on the Mafia series. It's been tremendous. I can't even thank you guys enough. Keep it up. And, uh... Thank you so much for watching. It's been your boy, BF Prodigy. And I'm out, y'all. Peace.